Number eight, a two kilograms object is subjected to three forces that give it an acceleration A of minus eight meters per square second in the I direction plus six meters per square second in the J direction. If two of the three forces are F1 equals to 30 newtons in the I direction plus 16 newtons in the J direction and F2 equals to minus 12 newtons in the I direction plus eight newtons in the J direction, find the third force. So we know from Newton's second law that the sum of the forces is equal to mass times acceleration. And in this case, we have three different forces. So F1 plus F2 plus F3 is equal to mass times acceleration. In this case, we know the acceleration we know F1 and F2, we know the mass, but we don't know uh, the third force F3, so we are going to isolate it. So F3 is equal to mass times acceleration minus F1 minus F2. So we just have to solve this equation over here. So F3 is equal to mass, which is 2 kilograms, times the acceleration, which is minus 8 in the I direction plus 6 in the J direction minus F1 which is 30 in the I direction minus 16 in the J direction. Remember that this minus sign over here comes from this minus over here. Uh, minus F2 which gives us plus 12 in the I direction minus 8 in, in the J direction. Remember this sign over here as well. So this gives us minus 16, making this multiplication over here, minus 16 in the I direction, minus 30 in the I direction, taking this term over here, plus 12 in the I direction, plus 12 in the J direction, minus 16 in the J direction, minus 8 in the J direction. And this over here gives us, let's see, minus 34 in the I direction, uh, minus 12 in the J direction. And don't forget to include the unit, which is Newtons. So this is the answer of this exercise, exercise number eight.